Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Ballroom. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that it's just to join me today as we talk here with Queenie. I don't know, it's a young girl. You see a young girl cleaning near the church. She has simple but good clothing. She doesn't seem to notice me. Okay, well, I'm apparently too ugly for her, so she's not interested for right now. I didn't, I couldn't figure out how to get in there. I. I mean, I've been trying, I've been messing around with that, but I, I can't really, I have no idea what I'm doing, so it's like, I'm just messing around, I don't know if, I don't know if it's a combination, or if it's an order, or what, I have no idea what that is, I kind of wish I did, but I, I don't, I don't know what that is, I, maybe we're gonna be able to go down there later on, but for right now, we're gonna need to continue looking for, um, well, we're going over there, well, actually, we're going over there, but I, what I really want is a, for a way, hurdle. Huh. What I really want is for a way for me to... Wait a minute, are we in Erdal? Oh yeah, apparently this is the city as well. Yeah, there's houses over here. Uh, I want a way to uh, go in between this village and... Or this map and the other map. So I can... I mean, be free. Because I... I be free, basically. That's, that's what it is. Because I still have stuff to explore on the other side. And I will do an episode of that. Better armor, take that. Because why not? Let's see what we have here. An empty copy of... Empty copy, empty cup of a coffee, and uh, yeah, I also went back home, I dro dropped some of my stuff, I slept, I ate, I drank, and everything is good to go for a brand new episode. I like it how, uh, how usually for the 25 to an half an hour, uh, 25 minutes to half an hour that I take to, to do an episode, it's usually from dawn to dusk, and yeah, that's pretty cool, it's pretty a pretty, cool, co pretty cool coincidence. So, yeah, it's not always like that, but, you know, sometimes, sometimes, not gonna say most of the time, but sometimes. Uh, so, yeah, let's get in here. There's nobody in here, so might as well get in here and loot this place. Ivo's cheap spirits. There's cheap and there's good. Uh, there's, oh, okay. Okay, right, right, left, left. There we go. What do we have here? Iron Soul Greaves. Well, it's not the first time we're seeing this particular set of items. Mm-hmm, Iron Soul, what the hell does that mean, anyway? I also made uh, some new arrows, so now I'm better equipped for anything that might happen to come across my way, or I to come across its way. And usually it's it's that way. Oh, oh those are flags? There's flags? How the hell? That's cool. Oh. It's like a castle sort of thing, maybe. With a moat, and there's like the, the walk, the, the, the causeway, I guess, would be the word for this. But this doesn't look too good, though. What happened in here? Is this the royal castle? There's guards. There's, uh... Creed. Hey, man. Can you tell me something? He must be in charge here, or at least he must be a very important person among the rebels. Oh, these are the rebels. Hey, I am kind of like the king's blood and all of that. Can I go upstairs? Don't even think about it. No one is allowed into the upper quarters of the castle. Okay, whatever. Well, there's no... From what I can tell, there's no upper quarters of the castle to begin with. So can I take your wood? I can. Okay, they're, they're nice fellows. I like the rebels. They're probably gonna have some motivation that will make us the bad guys or something. I never... I don't trust... I don't trust that the king was a good guy. I really don't. It's... Yeah, there's no way. Absolutely no way. So drink all of that. I will take the wood. I don't need the wood. There's a, I have a lot of it back home. But anyway, I'll take it. It's not that much either way, so... Oh, actually, there's some with four wood in that. Huh, cool. Let's see what we got here. Oh, I like this. Iron bars and coal and uh, silver and moonstone ore. It's very nice. Very, very nice. Uh, yeah, I I don't know what coal is used for. I suppose, Oh, actually, we were talking in the last episode about uh, fire arrows, so maybe it's coal. But I don't know. Actually, let's, let's give it a shot. Let's go into combine mode. Combine this. What happened there? Oh, you had to put them in the floor? Okay, take them all. <laughs> that was not scary at all, was it? Not for a moment there, I thought I had lost all my arrows. But no, that was not what happened. Okay, so I can't can't combine that. Maybe it's a crafting recipe or a, a building recipe or something. Anyway, in here we have the old shrines. Why is it called old shrines? Is that because it is for the old gods? And maybe those are the two gods? I could be. I don't know. Let's go in here. Uh, so these guys are nice. I'm not gonna want to fill up my my empty. I, actually, I probably don't have any empty things. Can he? Can I? Can? Oh, I can raid their stuff. 
These guys are so gullible. Well, not gullible is not the word. Dumb is the word. Anyway, take take all they have, because why not? Actually, this is quite good. Quite. I'll take all that. Thank you very much. Um, almost a lot of bread and onions as well. Not a big fan of onions, but you know, I'll take them. Um, wolves at wolves at the castle. Off the castle. Food for the wolves. The royal wolves need more more food. The large wolf, which always follows the king around, especially needs a lot of food. That thing always seems hungry, and I'm not going to cook for animals. Who do they think I am? And why do they let animals into the castle? Why do these animals serve the king? Yeah. What the hell's wrong with the king? Dealing with dragons and wolves and... I mean, I have nothing against wolves or, or dragons. No, actually, I have something against dragons. I, I don't like them. They're, they're mean and they... They, they, they hurt. Usually, to me, they hurt a lot when they attack. Anyway, I don't like dragons. Mm. But uh, yeah, so it's uh, it's kind of interesting. Let's take these. There's another thing here. A piece of exquisite cheese. I'll take that thing. Oh, there's stuff in the tables as well. No! Mm. This guy is not a big fan of me taking their stuff. But that's okay. I don't want to take all your stuff. Let me um, convince you that I'm your friend, because I got that ability here. Forget crime. Let's go into the P menu, because I remembered now. And I might be able to remember it from now on. Let's see. Cast that on him. Cast. Oh, it's right click. No fun. No fun of us. Go away. Go away. We're good. Okay. Whew. Fun of us is a piece of work. I don't know if maybe. Okay. He doesn't want me stealing this stuff. That's fine. I'm not like I'm not gonna do this again. Uh, so back here, this is not gonna be anything. I could take their stuff, but there's nothing here interesting anyway. Take all of that. Yeah. Oh, some moth dust. That's nice. And a bunch of empty glasses. Yeah, that's fine. You keep your whatever that is, fairy uh, fairy dust or wheat. I don't know. Whatever it doesn't matter. Uh, there's something down here. A frog. Okay. It's not very common to find frogs out in the wild. Actually, it's kind of tricky to see them. Oh, it's on the other side. Okay. Hello. Don't mind me. I'm uh, not stealing you at all. I'm uh, robbing you, I guess. No, steal. I'm not stealing you. I don't care. I don't want you for anything, so start shut up. Um, let's get back here as well. I kind of wanted to see... No, there's there wasn't anything in the... There's a, there was a bag, and the bag didn't have... Uh, one of these things, so there we go. Let's see what you get. Dark Iron. There is an old blacksmith legend that dark iron can only be made beyond the forgotten plains of Ballroom. The darkness infuses the iron and makes it even tougher. According to the legend, no mortal can smelt the iron, only an immortal blacksmith. Okay. So I don't know any immortal blacksmiths, but if I ma meet one, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll be sure to tell them, Hey, what about that black iron or dark iron or whatever? And they're gonna be like, Nope, that's not for you, dear sir. That is for me. A bunch of splints. I've never once used a splint, although I, I have had. Oh, still arrows, nice. Uh, oh, nice, simple arrows. That is okay by me. Running out of inventory space, though. Yeah, running out. Let's put this over here because we're not going to use these bows. So there we go. I think we're good to go. Let's get out of here. We have looted their place thoroughly enough. I would say, actually, no, we haven't. There's stuff over there. Yeah, these are the rebels. Don't forget that. I believe, actually, this... Oh, I can't... I can't go upstairs. That's cool. Okay, I can take this, and they don't mind. So let me read what is in here. Your commander is a traitor. He is helping the Darkwood Necromancers with their dark rituals. If you... If any of you have information on him, report immediately to the guild. Benedict is now an enemy of the realm. Benedict. The commander of the... Rebels? Consorting with the necromancers. Should I take that at face value? Is that true? Is that something that I care for, more importantly? Yeah, I can't go up the upstairs. Okay. So, yeah. The necromancers will... T I don't care. The necromancers have no leverage on me. For now. I mean, they're level 11 or 13 or whatever. They... Whatever level they were, but... That's not really the leverage I'm talking about right now. They have no leverage. They all will tell the rebels... And they the rebels will kill me. They need me. Yeah, we have gone over this before. Let's not worry about that too much. Uh, let's take those. I have a bunch of seeds. I have so many seeds. I have a full chest of them. And and more, I think. Actually, I don't have a full chest of them. Yeah, I don't. But yeah, I have a lot of seeds. 
a lot of it. Um, so yeah, it's, uh, not really sure I can use them at all or will ever be able to use them. Although I would like to, but unfortunately I don't know the, the that skill. In here, apparently these burn down, but there's stuff in here. Steel bars, ash ambrosia. There is more junk over here with burnt bread that I don't want. Thank you very much. Grave moss. More burnt deer meat. Actually, that's better than raw deer meat. At least uh, Jerry won't pop up out of the ground or for no reason whatsoever. No, not no reason, but yeah, it's going to be for the food. He wants the foods the little guy wants. Let's see what we got in here. What I really want, though, is... Ooh, a scalpel. Oh, that does a lot of damage. Thank you. It doesn't increase my dexterity, though, so... No, not going to use that scalpel. Gonna use this one. Oh, necromancers! More about the necromancers. I will read about. I will read about the necromancers in a little bit. A voodoo doll, a skull, a bunch of other stuff. Let's see. Oh, there's something here. Uh, moth dusts. Actually, we found. Look at this. Look at this. We found a major healing potion before. I don't remember where it was. It actually was in. Wasn't it in the, in the church or something? Yeah, I think we found it there, and they were very angry that we did. And the, I don't remember exactly where we did it. Oh, more of them! More major healing potions, that's good. We're finding a bunch of potions. This is really, really awesome. The That is gonna... Oh, uh, spider egg is not really what I want. I, I mean, you can farm them, I guess. You can farm spiders. I wonder why, though. Why would you want to farm spiders? Maybe th for their fangs? Mm, I don't know. Anyway, let's read about the necromancers. They are worshippers of the dead, black mages who seek immortality. They knew that Atticus and Eogor, Eogor won't grant them immortality. Only Narsus can give them what they need. Hmm, Narsus is the mad god, isn't it? Or am I wrong on that? I don't know, guys. Can't go in there. Okay, so let's uh, go around this thing. Uh, worry about those later. I think there's gonna be a house there, and actually I think there's gonna be- yeah, there's gonna be a house there. I think there's gonna be houses over there as well. I wonder what that is. Is that the castle? Could be the castle. Kinda looks like a little bit of a castle. I don't know. A couple of towers. And so we took that. And then something here. Let's take that as well. Soon enough I'm gonna need to go back home and drop a bunch of stuff as well. Man, the inventory management in this game. So much stuff that I steal. I like it. I like it though. Uh, so Sabrina. She doesn't mind me taking some flameberry seeds. Oh, look at that. We can't... No, we can't. We don't have the, the... Oh, she's fine. Okay. Probably won't be... She actually probably isn't. Yeah. There's nice stuff in here. A lot of money. And I will take it. She was calling for her help. She was saying that I was a thief. But I'm not a thief. I'm your friend. You just don't know it yet. And I haven't been your friend yet. That's also a, a factor. So can I cast this on you? Something is in the way. Let me let me get close to you, girl. I'm gonna be your friend. Now, Farnafus, you stop that. No, damn it! Well, I will take it. Oh man, wasting my spells. I guess I I've been safe scumming my way through them anyway. So let's let's do this. She's she, she's not gonna remember, is she? There we go. Now, Farnafus, can you please don't not be a meanie? Okay. Now she's gone. I might might as well st steal her stuff. There's stuff over there, and I will. Close that door. Close the door. God damn it, what the hell? Good. Beetle gland, okay. Didn't want to see that or have that, but sure, whatever. Something over there as well. She's not gonna come in here. It's gonna be fine. What do we have here? More oil, more beer, more spirits, I guess. Isn't spirits like white spirits? As in, like, vodka and just in What the hell is that, by the way? I Press the wrong key. What the hell is that? Oh, there it is. No, it's not. What, what did I pick up? That, that, that thing that I just picked up, what is that? There it is. Mahoka. It's very expensive, though. What the hell is Mahoka? A beautiful young woman stands in front of me. Her eyes are entrancing. She has thin red clothing that fits her body perfectly. Okay. Uh, I've heard that you... Oh, this is the, the brothel. Oh, I didn't know that. Um... Yeah, I've heard that you girls are taking trips to the rectory. Uh, there's nothing wrong about that. I just want to tell you that Father Malvin is angry about it. Father Malvin is angry? What a joke. More often than not, he shows up at our DOS doorstep. What a hypocrite that priest is. He wants all of us for himself. Huh. Yeah, I kind of figured that, actually. <laughs> and I just wanted to inform you that he's up to something. 
Thank you, but we can protect ourselves. If we lose a few customers here, we will find new ones there. Okay. You beautiful young woman with uh, the thin... What the hell is a thin... I guess it would be a thin cloth. The thin cloth that makes up the uh, or, or dress or something. I don't know. Let's take this. Mm-hmm. Take that. Why would there be... Why would there be... Oh, I didn't take whatever's in there. Why would there be a potion of transforming into a rat? Was it... What did I pick up? Potion of... In, in a brothel? Why? Hmm. Anyway. So, what is my quest? Malvin has been taking trips to the brothel. So, I, mean, uh, so I should talk to Malvin. Okay, let's do that. And also, let's go to the north from here because I saw a... Uh, what's it called? A mound of dirt. No, a dirt pile. It's always... It's basically the same thing. And I need to take all of these on my way there. I don't know how to craft these potions over here, so... I basically need to... Oh, wildwood leggings and snake scales. Uh, yeah, I, I need to take these as many of these as possible because I spent a bunch of them when I made like ten. It's 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 yeah, we need these we need these a lot. There's a level five stone golem. Oh, Jerry! It's been a while, Jerry. How's it going, man? Go away now. Can you go away now? Thank you. Your your pleasure. Oh, there's a cave there. I want to mark it on the map. So uh, uh so let's mark this as mm, um brothel brothel, and let's mark this as uh. Golem. Um, that's not. That's with the E. I mis mistyped that, but it's fine. Bird's nest. What? I got a bird's nest. An actual bird's. I didn't get the eggs. I didn't get the birds. I got the actual nest. We're now in Erdal, and th these golems. They they don't seem really that friendly. I'm level f six, by the way. I forgot about that. Yeah. Level 6 now, so I should be okay with those. Actually, I, I've killed level 5 golems before, so I should be totally okay. These houses, they don't... Oh, I haven't I haven't been in here. I've been to that one, but not these ones. So I might as well go there. Let's, let's go. There's somebody in here. Xander. Hey, Xander. Do you, do you know... Do you, I, you're having a weird name, you know that? I think that's not a real name. Is it a real name? It could be a, a real name. Okay, so forgive me. Oh no, he's gonna kill me. No, no, that's not. I I didn't want to do that either way, so it's fine. Um, yeah, but let's let's not steal this stuff. Uh, hey man, how's it going? You see a large man standing in front of me. He must have a high position with the rebels. His armor is different from the other rebels. He doesn't like the fact that I'm staring at him. You have a nice home here. Indeed, stranger. The house belonged to fat nobles. It was child's play to scare them away, but that was many years ago. Do you know what happened to them? No idea. I don't really care. They deserve the exp to experience a harder life. Why? The people hate us for invading your lands, but we deserve to be in charge. Your, cane, your kind king banished us to die. Banished you? When the people of the city decided to hide underground, they knew there was not enough space down there. Of course, only the ones who were wealthy enough made a list. Our poor peasants' ancestors were left behind to burn. To burn? The Mad God started to burn up Ballroom. He summoned meteors and incinerated people's homes just for fun. At that time, the council decided to move the city underground. Yeah, we've read about this. Where was the city that the Mad God destroyed? The city was built centuries ago into Darkwood. Dead legends say that the forest reclaimed the ruins of the city. There is nothing left of it. Only the underground city remains as a reminder of what happened. Well, I'll be on my way then. This guy, know this guy knows, what knows what's up. I think, maybe. Let's take his stuff, though, because he doesn't know that. Look at that. Is that a, a giant moth? I think that is a giant moth. A trophy. Mm, kind of want to know. There's... Some... It's kind of tricky to see these tables, but they are here. They have stuff. Mm -hmm. And now Zender. Can you go to that other side? That'd be nice of you. Can I... Monokan. They have names? No. What is that? That, looks... that sounds like a name to me. They are people. No, they're not. They're mannequins. It should be mannequin, not monokin. What the hell is that? Monokin? Monokin. I don't know. You're getting food. That's what matters. He doesn't see us from there, so that's perfect. Now, all I really wanted is to get... There we go. He's going. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. No, no. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Right. 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 Left. Left. No. Nope. Right. Left. Right. Left. There we go. Take that. Banded mail. Okay. Well, I'll see you later. <laughs> uh, oh man, we're overflowing with stuff, with food. Let's eat a few apples, or a few pears, I guess. 
be careful of the fed and we are good to go okay then uh, let's mark this over here as Xander's place just, so, just in case I need to see the guy and take his house for him from him uh, so we have been in there. This is the church. Okay, so we're in the right place. Let's talk to Malvin. Father Malvin and confront him about how beautiful that girl apparently was. Well, her eyes were but then the dress. So, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I still don't know what that is. I want to know, but I don't. So, let's have a chat with, with the father over here. Hey, I know that you have been sent uh, to where you have seen uh, you have been seen at the brother of father. Nonsense! What are you blabbering about? I talked to Sabrina, father. Sabrina? And you believe that little... Enough of this. Leave me, boy. No. Okay, and I gained the experience for basically... Absolutely no consequence whatsoever. That's fine. That's fine. Totally okay with that. Even though I would like him to not... I mean, I wouldn't like that, but that'd be a reactivity that I would uh, expect. Him not giving me his... Uh, his uh, services. But anyway, let's keep going. I need to find a smith. Oh, man. This place is all burned down. I mean, I guess it was the capital, so it makes sense that it all burned down. And I mean, the meteors and... But this was centuries ago. Well, they would have... The houses would be... Oh, hi! Didn't see you there, Mr. Snake. Can I kill you? I can't, unfortunately. You are a level 6 guy, so it's gonna be a little bit tricky to uh, convince you not to do such a thing to me. Let me see what I can do about... I missed the spell? Is that possible? Okay, so now it's blind. I am gonna move away from him, and Farnafus is gonna go there and smack him in the face. And I'm calling him him because uh, I'm making it. A, I'm doing that on purpose, even though Snake, as I said before, is female in Portuguese, so that'll be she. But since that makes a little bit less sense than like a chicken, I will call him him. Oh, alright, it's fine. It's totally okay. I'm gonna make you bleed, Mr. Snake. I'm gonna make you die. Okay. Okay, nice, and now this one will finish the deed, and down it goes, perfect, front of us, get out of there, dang it, and we got snake scale and snake fangs, as expected, I mean, it's a snake, so what else would you get, really, the scales, the fangs, you get the meat, maybe, oh, there's a huge rat in there, front of us, can you take care of that guy, I'll just right click front of us, I think front of us can take care of that guy, yep, Okay, that should work there. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do this. Okay, the rat is apparently not stunned. Hmm. And it has double turns. So, that's a thing. Now it's stunned, and I'm gonna kill it, I believe, like so. Okay, it's going well. It's going well. I'm confident about that golem, that stone golem we have up to the north. Let's see what we got over here. Dark wood. Okay, let's read about that. For their dark rituals, they chose dark wood. The woods hid the horrible things they did. The necromancers or the people that left here? I believe it's the people that left here. Centipede kitten. Okay, we've found centipede uh, legs before, but kitten is... Oh, it's a good thing there's no more space for a rotten apple, rotten pear, or anything, whatever that was. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna need to go back home and leave more stuff behind. All good. Rotten bread, don't want that, don't want that, there's nothing here. Okay, far enough, let me go. Uh, so let's keep exploring, there's a well there. The well kind of looks suspicious to me. Makes me think we are going to be able to go down it. Although that might not be, oh, there's something here. Well, there's a pot in the middle of nowhere. With a couple of potions, surprisingly enough. Uh, and, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go back over there, because we need to explore the city. Most of these houses are really not inhabited, so I don't want to mark them on the map. It's kind of weird. I mean, it, basically that means that there's not a whole lot of people living here. It's basically all that it means, because if there were more, they wouldn't... They would leave here, they would rep repair this stuff, right? Okay, so we're out of room. Let me see what I can do here. I, oh, there's a rat in there. Uh, let me see. I don't have anything here at level one. I, I could eat the bears. I don't need it, though. I don't need... Yeah, I'll, I'll worry about that later. Doesn't matter. Let's kill this rat. Let's kill this rat in the face. Or whatever you want, front of us. Go, go, go. Okay, there we go. The rat is now being attacked. I forgot to stun it. But that's fine. Okay, that's working according to my plan. 
There we go. An attack there, and I was stunned. Now this as well. And, uh, nope, not dead, but almost. And dead. Good. That's good. Okay, let's see what we got in here. Yeah, there's gonna be a lot of stuff that we're not gonna be able to carry if, unless I go back home. Let's see what he gets. Another empty oil glass. Actually, I could make oil, and that would take care of my inventory problem right now. Let's see. Do I have corn? I do have corn, so let's take care of that. Put that over there. Combine those two. There we go. And now I can take this. This. Okay, let's keep going. Oh, look at that. It's nighttime is falling. And uh, y'all are coming. I guess night is falling. Or the sun is falling. Or setting. I don't know. You guys know what I mean. It's the end of the episode. It's coming up. But look at the time. I look, I've just looked at the time and it's still not enough. I want to play a little bit longer for this episode. I usually go a little bit above Etta. Her clothes tell, tell me she is really wealthy and she is most certainly not starving. Uh, so I need someone to repair my worn items, please. Repair all that. Wait a minute. I need to sell my stuff. Mm-hmm. Okay, perfect. This is really good. Okay, I will sell her a bunch of stuff that I have around here. She doesn't... Oh, she does have a lot of money, so let's do that. Scalpel, uh, let's see, stuff that's below five, oh, rusty sword, sell that. That's below 500 Thaler, I guess the poison fang can go. Uh, the battle staff, yeah, really can go, that one cannot, so let's sell these. Armor, oh, she sell, she buys everything, that's amazing. Sell that, sell that, sell that. Uh, okay, that's good. She has a lot of money, this is really good. Okay, what do we have here? Hat of the Seas, don't need that, don't need that. What is this one? Dexterity, wood pants, don't want that. Uh, yep, sell, sell this as well. Man, she has so much money, this is really, really good. I mean, I don't need the money, but at least we're getting rid of all this crap. And, without, uh, and um, not basically letting it be, uh, letting it uh, rot away at home, because that's what I do with all the items. Just leave them there. Nobody's gonna, ever gonna use them. There's a lot of interesting stuff in here, though, but I can't... I... Oh, man. Yeah, I don't need that. That's a good one. That's a good one. It, it, unfortunately, it doesn't, I, it doesn't change my dexterity, but that's good. Thieves' gloves, all that. And we're also getting a bunch of crap, to be honest. Oh, sneaking boots. Do I want those? Uh, I'll, I'll worry about them later. Golden necklace. Nope, don't want that. The robes of the necromancer, not gonna sell them right away. Gladiator's boot. Or, or gladiator boots. Um, hmm. Yeah, sell them. Oh, okay, so she's out of money. Let's see what about those boots, though. So, those boots are increasing dexterity. Yeah, they're good, but not as good as mine. Which is good, because they're good and the, yeah, mine are better. So, that's awesome. Okay, so I think that's about it for this episode. I think we are good now that we have repaired all of our stuff and sold a bunch of our crap. I, I am going to need to go back home, though, to drop you know the food and all the stuff that I have that I don't need. But for right now, I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been Ballroom. I really hope you've enjoyed it. And if you did, go ahead and leave a comment, like the video. But above all, thank you so much for watching, and I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.